How nice is being back in Charleston? You can't beat this place. <laughs> you really can't. It's the best ever. An early morning in Charleston, South Carolina means only one thing for Russell Henley. Breakfast. Hi guys. Hey. Three little birds. Are you guys all set to order? I got a couple buddies in town. I like to grab a little breakfast. I love food. Charleston has the best food in the world, so I try to find all the best restaurants. Three Little Birds, that place is so good. Almond with avocado and cheese. Okay. And uh, side of fruit. Okay. Do they do just avocado and cheese? Yeah. Okay. Oh, actually, can I get ham there too? Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Today, Henley is meeting up with his pals, Justin Bulware, Philip Malika, and college roommate Rob Bennett. Make sure you zoom in on that right there. I might have to get a bite of that. I'm sure they'll bring it over here. I had a little avocado, ham, and cheese omelet. Everything's so fresh. The fruit is just very fresh. That place is great. Mm. You good? Everything is so good. Rob Bennett and I, every time he comes in town, we eat there every morning for breakfast because it's so good. He says it has really fine joe, whatever that means. It's so good, and it's just a relaxed environment, and it's a great spot to go to eat. After breakfast, the group heads over to another of Henley's low country favorites, the Country Club of Charleston. Just look at that view right there. That's why I love this place. Beautiful views, great golf, better people. <laughs> the members are great here too. They've been so nice to me since I joined and called me one of their own. It's very old school, it's very traditional uh, Seth Rainer design. The greens have a little bit of undulation. They're pretty big and they're always perfect. I mean, I love these greens. Three reachable par fives. The par threes are challenging just like on tour. So it really brings a great practicing course for me to the table. Catch up to that one, Phil. Yeah, I like to play and play against guys and play teams. And I've never been a big range guy. I like to get on the course and play. A lot of guys do it a different way, but this course is great for that. It's always in great shape. And I like to get out there and try to make some birdies and get the confidence up. So I do a lot of playing when I'm in town. <sighs> See ya. Ah, oh, you're good. Yes. <laughs> I play football in college. Hey, how far do you hit it? Go in the bunker and plug. Sit. Thank you. It's my partner right there, baby. That was lucky. You know, you'd think if I would find some friends come in town and play golf and they'd take it easy on me. It's not the case. And they badmouth me while I'm trying to get better. Woo! I always love talking trash to my friends. That's one of my favorite things to do. You know, they talk trash to me just like I talk to them, and we have fun. I mean, I was their friend way before I won a PJ Tour event. They don't treat me different, and I think if they did, I think we would have some issues. Come on. Uh oh. <laughs> Can't believe you made another putt. <laughs> Today, Henley and the boys have no complaints. Beautiful day, spectacular setting, and a carefree outlook on life. Skyball. They're just like me. They like to play golf and have fun. We have a lot in common, and just went out there and just enjoyed a nice day. Thanks, dude. Enjoyed it. I'm 23 years old. I am playing golf on the PGA Tour, and at the same time, I'm just still a kid just trying to have fun. We got a point there, didn't we? Yeah, one. <laughs>